Hello everyone, it's Taylor Simon with TaylorMade Consulting Agency, an elite performance and full creative media firm. You guys, I wanna welcome you to my IG bio website link template training. But first of all, I wanna thank you so, so much for purchasing this template. So if you're wanting to make your website IG bio link pop, I absolutely 100% believe that this template is for you. I don't know about you, but for so long, I have literally been bored with my link tree link template. I think that it's just, it didn't really complement my brand. It didn't really give me that beauty and that aesthetic that I was looking for. And so I decided to make something very unique, something that really stood out to really complement my brand. And so let's go ahead and get started. Scroll down to the bottom of the PDF document that I sent you and click on download template here. Once you click on that button, it will send you to this page here and then you will click on use template. So now that you have access to this template, automatically saves into your personal Canva account. And so you don't have to worry about trying to make an additional copy unless you just want to edit another one in, in the near future. So every element in this template is 100% customizable. And so let's try here. So say for instance, if you wanted to change the button uh, color and also the text and in addition to the link, all you would need to do is click on top of the button. And as you can see here, it's highlighted. You would actually come here and you can change all of, change um, the color of this button to any color that you want it to be. Of course, if you have the upgraded version of Canva, you can actually apply your brand color into this template and so I'm gonna go ahead and try it I'm gonna change it to this color right here and well I'm gonna change it to, to the green to make it pop and so if you would like to actually change the text as you can see here these elements are grouped together and so what you're going to do before you change the text is click go uh, click this button that says ungroup and you would then be able to to click on the text and change the text so I'm going to change this to for example Let's see, my upcoming webinar course. And you can put whatever you wanna put here. Once you do that, you would find the URL that you want to apply to this button. And so what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna to go to my website. I'm gonna just use my website URL. And so once I got my website URL, I'm just going to click here. And then you're going to click these three buttons here to go to the link button. You click on the link button and then you would, then you would paste your link there and you would click apply. If you don't want your text underlined, you would click on it and then all you would need to do is just press the underline button. Once that is all finished, you would then press the text and the button and then you can feel free to group it again and there you go. Just to kind of recap, all you need to do is copy the URL that you want to apply to the button and then paste it by clicking on this button here and then going to the link button there and then pasting it into the slot here, okay? Alrighty, so as it relates to the buttons, all of these buttons, these social media buttons are 100% customizable and you can also apply to a link to those as well. And once again, you would click on that button and you would click on the link button here at the top and you would apply your URL there and click apply. Another thing here is that I also have a button here that you can use. It is also 100% customizable. You would just need to change your text and just put your name here. And then I'm going to change the color and you can change the color of that. All you need to do is highlight it, click here, change the color. To change your image, all you need to do is double click on this circle press delete and drag and drop your image. And so I'm gonna find another image here. I'm gonna click this image and I'm gonna drag and drop my image there and there you go. Up here is actually where my logo is and you can feel free to apply your logo there as well. You do, All you need to do is just press delete and then also drag and drop your logo there. So as it relates to these animated graphics, I think this is so cool. If you want to change these animated graphics, all you would need to do is go here where it says elements, type in animation at the top, 